I bought it from a guy who got it out of a storage unit in Wichita, Kansas, where I live. He didn't quite know what to do with it, and I'm a, an addictions counselor, so I, <laughs> I thought I kind of needed this. I, so, I think it goes with your line yeah. of work. It's a wonderful movie. It was an informational movie put out in 1936 by a gentleman named Dwayne Esper. And Dwayne Esper actually had his wife write the screenplay for this. It was deadly serious. For instance, I had a, an uncle who was at college in Montana who his parents went up to Montana and pulled him out of school because he was smoking a reefer in the 30s. And yeah. so, so it's it was kind of, they saw it as a major problem. I love the headlines on it though. Yeah. Marijuana, weed with root in hell. It's just kind of campy now. It's right. it's become so campy. The plot is there are some college girls which go to, they go to a party and at the party they drink alcohol, they get drunk and then they end up mistakenly smoking marijuana. From then, their lives just cascade out of control. The one character, the main character, she has an affair with the drug dealer, has a child out of wedlock, gives the child up for adoption. The drug dealer is killed, and by the end of the movie, she becomes a drug dealer. It's very, uh, shall we say, allegorical to drive a point home. Right. What do you think you're going to do with it? <laughs> I, I haven't quite figured it out. I, I've had it for about three years now, and uh -huh. I've been kind of debating what to do with yeah, it, actually. Yeah. What well, kind of suits you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, I, I, I think it's a wonderful thing. Yeah. I like over-the-top things, you know. Yeah. I, yeah. That's just kind of my it's, collecting. It's pretty level. striking, I'll say that for it. It's a piece that I think it's rare enough. I'm going to I'm going to be really conservative with you. I'm going to put a value of 2000 to 3000 at auction or in a retail setting. I believe that that's a conservative estimate though. It's uh, almost become a counterculture icon at this point. Yeah. So it's that's kind a, of timely right now.